This is Ryan Abraham for USCFootball.com following USC's 48-0 victory over the Utah State Aggies here in the Coliseum for the home opener, the first shutout the Trojans have had since 2011 when it was 50 to nothing against UCLA. Re revisiting my three keys to victory, nailed pretty much all of them. Uh, first one, though, I wanted four sacks from this USC defense. They end up getting three, but seven tackles for a loss. A lot of pressure. Again, Utah State was trying to get the ball out quickly. But uh, I thought the Trojans did a really good job up front. They didn't let Bryson Barnes run all over him like he did last time. He was in the Coliseum playing for Utah. So did a pretty good job there. Two, I wanted to see the second key, USC get at least 200 yards rushing. Before the final two kneel downs to end the game, USC had 253 yards on the ground. Five touchdowns, averaging over seven yards a carry. So they did a really nice job uh, running the football, especially in the first half. So certainly hit that key. And the one I'm the most proud of, my third key to victory, Jaden Maiava, the backup quarterback, getting a rushing touchdown. He did on a scramble, a seven-yard run uh, in the fourth quarter, getting that rushing touchdown. I thought if Jaden Maiava was in the game, he was able to get a rushing score. The game was uh, out of reach. USC did what they needed to do, and uh, that's exactly what happened there. So 48 to nothing on a weird night or a weird day in college football when a lot of strange things happened. USC took care of business and could be looking at a top 10 ranking with all the other teams that were not playing well uh, earlier in the day. So this is Ryan Abraham signing out for the Coliseum. Make sure you check out uscfootball.com for more.